Welcome to the Plainfield Township water treatment plant in the surrounding area. We get all our water from wells, which is a groundwater source. This is our east well field that has six wells in it, and they can pump up to 1,400 gallons a minute. And to the west of the plant, we have another six wells. Directly behind me is our chlorine room. When it's under pressure, it's a liquid, and then we draw it off as a gas and inject that in the water. It's for the elimination of bacteria. We've now entered the plant proper, and where we're standing right now is chemical area number two. This is where we have all of our bulk chemical storage. To my left, we have a, a large tank that holds a thousand gallons of hydroflow silicic acid, and that's commonly called fluoride for the uh, prevention of dental caries and teeth. And the big tank behind us, the 6,500 gallon tank, is aluminum sulfate, another chemical that we use in the water treatment process. We also add phosphate in bags and mix it in a big tank. Any chemical that we put in the water is safe for human consumption and we carefully monitor that through the whole uh, treatment process. We're standing in the filter pump area of the East Water Treatment Plant. We have eight filter pumps here. Each can pump one million gallons of water a day, which equals eight million. And you add the eight million on the west side, that gives us our 16 million gallon a day uh, treatment capacity. This is kind of the end of the process. We treat the water before it comes here. All these pumps do is pump it out to the tanks in front and they re-pump it out to the distribution system. We're now standing in a clarifier room. Clarifier is also called a softening unit. We soften the water by taking hardness out of the water in the, in the form of calcium and magnesium. This particular clarifier processes two million gallons of water a day. What we do is add supersaturated calcium in a slurry to the middle of this clarifier, it reacts with a normal, natural calcium in the water, binds together, makes bigger particles, and falls out to the bottom of this 18-foot deep basin. The clarified, softened water rises then, and is collected and sent to the next part of the process. This is a filter room for the yeast plant. Again, we have eight filters here. Each process one million gallons of water a day, so eight million out of these plant alone. Here, we're using granular activated carbon for the removal of PFAS. It's been a very successful project for us. Now all our filtration is under granular activated carbon. We're now in the low service pump room of the water treatment plant. Behind me we have three pumps. What this does is takes water that we store out in front in our large four million gallon tank and our two million gallon tank, takes treated, purified, clean water, and pumps it out to the distribution system, but specifically to our low service area that serves Northland Drive and the lower regions of Plainfield Avenue. Behind us, we have the filter pump room for the West Plant. These filters can pump two million gallons of water in a 24 hour period. Everything in the West Plant has half as many units, but twice the size. This is the raw water chamber for the West Plant. This blue pipe here is a distribution pipe that goes to the intermediate pressure system. It crosses the Grand River and feeds the north side of our distribution area. The green pipe down here, color is very significant in the water treatment plant, is raw water. Blue pipe means drinking water. We are a lime softening plant. This is a lime slaker room. Above us, we have a 120 ton bin by Fear Cates. Feeds these motors. There's a screw feeder that delivers the lime to the slaker body. It's then mixed, water is added to it, turns it into a slurry, we add it to our clarifiers, and that's how we start the softening process. Lime comes to us in 50 ton loads, double bottom trucks, it's blown up to the silo under pressure, and then by gravity it feeds these machines. The lime is actually limestone. We get it from the western UP out of a lime quarry. It has to be 99% pure. After the limestone is processed, more water is added, it's super saturated, it looks like milk, and then it's pumped up to our clarifiers and completes the softening process. This is our intermediate service pump room. There are five pumps in there. We can pump up to 20 million gallons a day out of this one pump room. It pumps water into the distribution system. Again, it draws from the reservoirs out back and we pump it to our intermediate system, which is a large portion and probably the majority of our distribution system. And then from there goes to our customers, to their houses, homes, and businesses. Thank you for visiting with us. So that's it for part one. Stay tuned for part two. We've got some more excitement ahead.